If you are trying to record your screen and webcam at the same time on Windows, you'll want to use OBS. Even though it's free and open source, you get professional results. Here's how to get started. If it isn't already installed, you'll need to download and set up OBS from the link in the description below. When the app loads for the first time, you'll be prompted to set up your default settings through its auto configuration menu. For the first setting, choose Optimize Just for Recording, then hit Next. You'll then be asked to check your video settings. Double check to make sure you're satisfied with them before clicking Next. The app will then test your settings before showing you a final overview. Feel free to look this over, then click Apply Settings once you're satisfied. Once that's done, you'll need to set what you want to record. Under the Sources menu at the bottom left, click on the plus icon to add your screen by clicking Display Capture. Click OK on the first menu. A live preview of your desktop will then replace the black screen above. If you have multiple monitors set up, select which monitor you want to record on the next menu. Otherwise, just click OK. To add your webcam, click on the plus icon again and select Video Capture Device. Click OK on the first menu. On the second menu, you'll be asked to select your webcam. The app will turn on the selected device for you to preview. To select a different camera, click on the drop-down menu next to Device for a list of detected cameras. Once you click OK, a screen will appear above displaying a live video feed from your selected camera. To resize your webcam window, click and drag on any of the red dots along the red border while your webcam screen is selected. To reposition it, simply click and drag the screen itself. When it comes to sound, the app detects any integrated microphone and speaker output automatically and records by default. If you don't want to record your voice or sound that plays from programs and videos, click on the speaker icon under mic or desktop audio, respectively, to mute recording. Once this is all set up, the app will save your settings automatically for future sessions. Now that it's set up, recording your video is pretty straightforward. To start recording, just click on Start Recording at the bottom right and minimize the app. Once you're done, bring it back up and click on Stop Recording on the same menu. To access your recorded videos, click on File at the top left, then select Show Recordings. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos for on-screen recording and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.